Hello there. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I will take you through gyroscopic couple and precessional motion in mechanics of machines too. Let's begin with this question. The turbine rotor of a ship has a mass of 8 tons and a radius of gyration 0.6 meters. It rotates at 1800 RPM clockwise when looking from the stern. Determine the gyroscopic couple, if the ship travels at 100 km per hour and steer to the left in a curve of 75 meters radius. Solution Given M equals 8000 kg K equals 0 0.6 meters N equals 1800 rpm V equals 27.8 meters per second R equals 75 meters Finding the mass moment of inertia. I equals 2880 kilograms squared meters. Finding the angular velocity omega. Omega equals 188.5 radians per second. Finding the angular velocity of precession omega p. Omega p equals 0 0.37 radians per second. Finding the gyroscopic couple. C equals 200.866 kN. When the rotor rotates in clockwise direction when looking from the stern and the ship steers to the left, the effect of the reactive gyroscopic couple is to raise the bow and lower the stern. Here is a second question. The heavy turbine rotor of a sea vessel rotates at 1500 rpm clockwise looking from the stern, its mass being 750 kg. The vessel pitches with an angular velocity of 1 radian per second. Determine the gyroscopic couple transmitted to the hull when bow is rising, if the radius of gyration for the rotor is 250 millimeters. Also show in what direction the couple acts on the hull. Solution Given N equals 1500 rpm M equals 750 kilograms Omega P equals 1 radian per second. K equals 0 0.25 meters. Finding the mass moment of inertia. I equals 46.875 kilograms squared meters. Finding the angular velocity omega. Omega equals 157.1 radians per second. Finding the gyroscopic couple. C equals 7.364 kN. When the bow is rising, that is, when the pitching is upward, the reactive gyroscopic couple acts in the clockwise direction which moves the sea vessel towards starboard. Here is a third question. The turbine rotor of a ship has a mass of 3,500 kilograms. It has a radius of gyration of 0.45 meters and a speed of 3,000 rpm clockwise when looking from stern. Determine the gyroscopic couple and its effect upon the ship. 1. When the ship is steering to the left on a curve of 100 meters radius at a speed of 36 kilometers per hour. 2. When the ship is pitching in a simple harmonic motion, the bow falling with its maximum velocity. The period of pitching is 40 seconds and the total angular displacement between the two extreme positions of pitching is 12 degrees. Solution Given M equals 3,500 kilograms K equals 0 0.45 meters. N equals 3000 RPM. R equals 100 meters. V equals 10 meters per second. TP equals 40 seconds. 2 phi equals 12 degrees. 1. Finding the mass moment of inertia. I equals 708.75 kg squared meters. Finding the angular velocity omega. Omega equals 314.2 radians per second. Finding the angular velocity of precession omega p. Omega p equals 0 0.1 radians per second. Finding the gyroscopic couple. C equals 22,270 newton meters. When the rotor rotates clockwise when looking from the stern and the ship takes a left turn, the effect of the reactive gyroscopic couple is to raise the bow and lower the stern. 2. Finding the amplitude of swing. Phi equals 0 0.105 radians per second. 
finding the angular velocity omega 1 of simple harmonic motion. Omega 1 is equal to 0.157 radians per second. Finding the maximum angular velocity of precession. Omega p equals 0.0165 radians per second. Finding the gyroscopic couple. C equals 3675 newton meters. When the bow is falling, that is, when the pitching is downward, the effect of the reactive gyroscopic couple is to move the ship towards port side. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. I am Engineer Mayday, when you need help Mayday is the call. You have been an interactive learner. Thank you.